Have you ever wondered whether lightning exists on Venus, our neighboring planet? It's a question that has sparked a heated debate among the scientific community for years. You see, the mysterious light flashes recorded by previous Venus missions have led some to suspect the presence of lightning. However, there's a twist. Unlike Earth, Venus's clouds lack water. Now why is this significant, you ask? Well, here on Earth, water is a key player in creating electrical charges, setting the stage for the spectacular light show we call lightning. But on Venus, this essential ingredient is missing. This raises the question, if there's no water, what's causing these light flashes? Could it be lightning, or is there another explanation? The puzzle of Venus's potential lightning is as fascinating as it is perplexing. But, if water is absent in Venus's atmosphere, what then could be the cause of the recorded light flashes? This enigma continues to captivate scientists. And as we delve deeper into the mysteries of our solar system, we may soon find the answer. A recent study has shed light on this mystery, and the answer may surprise you. For years, scientists have been puzzled by the source of light flashes on Venus. The key to this enigma, it appears, lies not in the expected lightning strikes, but in an entirely unexpected phenomenon. This new study suggests that the culprits of these light flashes are meteors, burning up high in Venus's atmosphere. That's right, space rocks, hurtling through the sky and disintegrating about 62 miles from Venus's surface, may be responsible for most, if not all, of these observed flashes. This is a significant departure from previous theories which hinged on the presence of lightning, a phenomenon considered unique due to Venus's waterless clouds. But the evidence now points towards these fiery meteors, painting the Venusian sky with their ephemeral light. So it seems instead of lightning, it's meteors that are putting on a light show in Venus's sky. What does this mean for future missions to Venus? With the recent findings suggesting that the light flashes on Venus are more likely the result of meteors burning up high in the atmosphere, rather than lightning, the threat posed to future missions might be considerably diminished. This could be a game-changer for our exploration plans. However, it's important to note that for missions involving long-lived aerial platforms, which are intended to hover in the planet's clouds for about a hundred Earth days or more, the scenario could be a bit different. In this case, a lightning strike is more likely to occur if the probe finds itself within 56 miles from the surface of Venus. So, while the threat of lightning may not be as significant as once thought, it's still a factor that needs to be considered in the planning and execution of future missions. But isn't that what makes space exploration so exhilarating? The unknown, the unexpected, the mysteries that await us in the vast expanse of space? While the threat of lightning may not be significant, it's clear that Venus continues to hold many mysteries for us to unravel. Subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay in touch with the latest in science.